Um, honestly, I think more and more retailers are going to go away. Uh, more and more big names that we see today, if they don't actually follow where the, the world is going, I think they're going to go away. And I think that's very evident with, you know, places like uh, Sears and, and, and I think JCPenney is also going away. But Toys R Us, um, although they're making a comeback now after they went away for a little bit. But, um, you know, I think e-commerce is a new way of life. My name is Bashar Ketu, and uh, I am an Amazon FBA seller, have been selling since about 2015. Um, just recently, actually, I started coaching back in 2019 and um, currently have 200 and about 50 something students. So the first actually three products I launched back in 2016 were a molecular model kit, which is a little atoms and bonds uh, a little kit where you use in a science class. And then the second thing was a, um, a faucet extender. And the third product was a um, a Nerf gun vest kit. It's like the little thing that has, uh, you know, bullets and um, um, like goggles and things like that for kids. You know, actually first sale that I made online wasn't from private label, it was arbitrage. That's when I started in 2015 after my restaurant burned down. And um, to be 100% honest with you, it was the greatest feeling ever because before that I was, you know, used to, you know, working 120 hours, running a restaurant, you know, managing tens of employees, had to buy the food, prep the food, sell the food in order for me to make a sale. So the fact that I could be sitting behind my laptop and, and making on an online sale that I had nothing to do with, you know, selling to the customer was the greatest feeling ever. They say the average millionaire has seven streams of income. I always say, why should your Amazon business only have one product? It's about not trading your Amazon, your, especially your first Amazon product, as your little newborn child and literally launching more because I've been, you know, I've launched over a hundred products in the past couple of years that I've been selling on Amazon. And until this day, I'll launch products that just won't go to do anything, you know? So, but it, it doesn't matter, right? I've spent two, three thousand dollars on these products. It's okay. You know, get your money back and then just simply, you know, uh, uh, launch another product. So not focusing on one product, you know, following someone else's footsteps, having a step by step system and not focusing on one product, um, I think will, will definitely help you to build a brand because we're building brands here. It's not, you know, like this is a way of life, right? You, you don't want to replace a, 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 a dead end job with another dead end job that you're stuck, right? What if your Amazon listing goes down? So it's about simply building multiple streams of income within your Amazon business and then just simply thinking outside of the box, being different than everyone else on the marketplace. And also one of the main important things are um, don't look around your house when you want to sell on Amazon. You know, like just because you're a consumer of a product doesn't mean it's going to do well on Amazon. And that's where many people fail. You know, it's probably the greatest uh, feeling ever. I still remember Zach Brown, one of our, my top students, uh, you know, about a year ago, reached out one day and he said, Bashar, we hit 1K, 100K a month. And my wife looked at me and was like, wow, aren't you jealous? And I'm like, jealous? What do you mean by jealous? How could I be jealous? I mean, this is a guy who was 23 years old driving for FedEx, working 50 hours a week, and now I have literally changed his life forever, you know? Zach now does over $165,000, $170,000 a month, but like that was the literally the great, like it's literally, it feels better than me hitting a million dollars selling on Amazon to see someone actually really making it using my teachings because I know, like this is when I, when I said legacy, that's my legacy, right? Is changing someone else's life forever.